You may think of softball as simply a game, but for Anaya Oglesby and her father, it is their game. I started playing because my dad, he had, was in a men, men's league and I was ready and I was like, I wanna play. Like, this is for me, I wanna play and I want you to teach me. I told her, I said, look, there's no quitting. Once you start, that's it, you're gonna finish. And she was like, uh, okay. I said, okay, well, let's, let's do it. The two of them did not waste any time. That night started looking for gloves, bats, bat bags. He wanted nothing but the best. Can you blame him? We have a hidden net at the house. We practice. I, I went all out, all out. We have a string hook from two trees with waffle balls on it, and I make her hit those. We go to the park around the street from the house, and I pitch to her, and I hit to her, and everything. Wayman Rose has six children, and his youngest child, Anaya, is the only other softball player in the family. I'm loving watching her play to see that, wow, I taught her how to play. Although she is wearing number six tonight, she typically wears number 16, following in her dad's softball footsteps. 16, he had that since his high school career, so I decided might as well follow after the guy who inspired me. She was inspired, and now she is inspiring others. Anaya is one of only 60 athletes from across the country who received an invitation to attend an elite softball development camp over Memorial Day weekend. I was thinking, like, I didn't really have thoughts. I was just so overwhelmed. I was ready to pack, ready to get on the road, ready to go to Kansas. She took off on Thursday morning, but thankfully, she is only a FaceTime call away from her family. I told her FaceTime. We both have iPhones. I say FaceTime me all the time. She's like, I'm not FaceTiming you. I said, well, I'll FaceTime you. <laughs> She would like to play softball in college, and she tells me that dozens of coaches have already contacted her. To add to that, she would like to become a doctor. As always, if you are aware of any local sports stories, I want to tell them. You can contact me at gshirley at wfla.com. I'm reporting here in Hillsborough County. Gabrielle Shirley, News Channel 8 Sports.